Hi, I'm Jeremiah Thomas' mom. And uh, many of you follow Jeremiah's story. He was 16 years old, an all-star football player um, that was suddenly struck down with an aggressive bone cancer. From the time he was first diagnosed with this tumor to when he went to be with the Lord, we had 224,780 minutes with him. And every minute was precious. I'm sitting in my car outside of the cemetery. Whew. I was going to do this by his grave. I just can't get out of the car. This is an appeal to Governor Greg Abbott. First, I want to say thank you so much, Governor and Mrs. Abbott for reaching out to our family, for ministering to us in our time of need. When Jeremiah was struck down with cancer and with terminal cancer, he was given an opportunity to make a wish. And rather than make a wish for, for himself, he made a wish to speak with you, Governor Abbott so that he could personally request that you use your executive power to abolish abortion in the state of Texas. The people that follow Jeremiah's story, who prayed for him, who ministered to us, loved, loved that wish. And there was an army of social media warriors that shared this throughout not just Texas and our nation, but throughout the world. And you heard about his plight. And um, your lovely wife reached out to my son on social media and encouraged him while he was in the children's hospital. Thank you. And then you called him while he was at McLean's Children's Hospital. And you spoke with him what you probably don't realize and what many people who followed the story didn't know is when you called he was in great pain in fact he was in such pain when your staff called called the hospital and told them that you would be calling I woke my son up and I asked him I said Jeremiah the governor's going to call you, son, but are you up to it, honey? Can you do this? I remember he was clutching one of those um, plastic vomit bags because um, he was so ill. And he put it down and he just, he just wiped his mouth and he said, Mom, I have to do this. I have to do it for the babies. He was in so much pain, but it didn't matter. You were calling. He, summons the, he summoned the last ounce of strength he had to take your phone call. <laughs> we're so glad. We're so glad that you reached out to him. And when you promised to make his wish come true, when you said your wish is granted, his face lit up and he had the biggest smile. So thank you, Governor Abbott. Thank you. Thank you for your love and your compassion and your promise. And I want to, in turn, promise you something. I promise to pray for you, to pray for your wife, to pray for your family, and to stand with you as you make that promise a reality in the state of Texas. And I can also assure you that the very, very large group of people that supported Jeremiah will now support you as you bring his wish, um, when you make his wish come true. They are ready to pray for you. They are ready to work with you tirelessly as you bring about the abolition of abortion in the state of Texas. So thank you, Governor Abbott. And we stand ready to help you fulfill your promise to our son, Jeremiah.